Welcome to Iowa Live, everyone. It is a Monday, so how about we find out what we can catch in Des Moines this week? Brock Conrad from Catch Des Moines joining us here in studio. Good to see you, buddy. Nice to see you. Thanks for having me on. A lot of things going on. Beautiful weather today, number one. So uh, get out and enjoy yourself. Get out and enjoy the trail. Get on a bike. Do something yep. like that. But what else do we have going on that would be pretty cool to do yes. when weather's like this? Well, weather, right? Yeah. Uh, good weather. How about some Iowa Cubs baseball? Iowa Cubs, none better. That's right. So they have a big home stand happening this week. Uh, so you can catch them tomorrow through Sunday. They'll be taking on the Columbus Clippers each day. And so you can visit Iowa Cubs website to view uh, all their game promotions and different pitch times. Tickets start at just $9. Yeah, where can you go for under 10 bucks and see some uh, some people play baseball yep. that who knows the people you could be seeing on the field, yep. uh, you know, come down the road here in just a little bit. You could turn the tube on and see them playing professional baseball. That's right. Yep. Future stars and even some stars that come down and that's right. Rehab, so the yeah. rehab stuff. Yep. Yeah, yep. but the Iowa Cubs is so fun. They, yep. That ballpark is absolutely outstanding and no better view in minor league baseball than to be at the batter's box and look out and see the Capitol yes. right over center field. Yes, I like the little bit to the right. You can see the Capitol and you can see a little bit of the Des Moines skyline. Too. Absolutely. That's my favorite part. Yeah, yeah, that is great. Now, yes. uh, so people are looking forward to enjoying themselves outside with the Iowa Cubs, but now people are looking forward to something else making a return to Des Moines. Yes, it's Hamilton. So Hamilton. Super popular musical is back at the Des Moines Civic Center. We're really excited about that. It it, um, it's a story of America then told by America now and okay. features blends of hip hop, jazz, R&B, and Broadway. And tickets range for that show between $59 and $229. Um, and it's here until June 5th. So there's going to be some different opportunities to be able to see it, but it's a very popular show. Did you have a chance to see it the first time it went I, through? I haven't, no. You need to go. Yeah, I know. yeah, Kathy and I went, and it was one of those things where you sat back in your seat and you went, wow, this is really cool. And a whole different perspective on what history was like with a modern twist. Yes. Which was really cool. Cool. Yes, and that's what I've heard from a lot of people is if you haven't been to a Broadway show that this is a really good one to go to yeah, your first one. So, exactly. Yeah. I heard they had you down for playing a role in this, but you had to turn it down because you were too busy. Yes, too yeah. busy. I was yeah. a lead role, but yeah, I uh, turned it okay. down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's awesome. Now, oh. what about something else that you can't turn down because it's something else that is a whole lot of fun? Yes. So the summer concert series out at Jasper Winery How is about returning that? this week. Awesome. Yes, we're really excited about that. It, uh, it starts this Thursday from 6 to 9 p.m., and it's a good chance to listen to a lot of great music. This week will be Brother Trucker. Oh, really? Yes. Awesome. Love yeah. Brother Trucker. Oh, they are great. Yes. yes. And so you're encouraged to come out there, bring your own lawn chairs or blankets for outdoor seating. Uh, they'll have burgers and brats available as well as some food trucks and you're welcome to bring your own food as well. And the great thing about this event too is it is free. So uh, it's a good one to bring kids out to. I know I'll bring my kids out there on Thursday. How about that? Yeah, and it is such a great time and the, the musicians that are out there, they so appreciate everybody coming out and be able to enjoy, enjoy themselves yes. at a free event like this, which is uh, what Des Moines is really getting known for. I'm sure the Catch Des Moines folks are real happy yep. about that too. Yeah, absolutely. We have a lot of different events that we categorize differently, but we have uh, one on our website where we have free events and that's a very popular one you know if people are looking to get out and do things with their family out um, in, De in greater des moines and it's it's a good opportunity mm -hmm. to do that at jasper winery uh, so, yeah. the, the free concert series that yep. is cool and how about just having fun in general getting down to fun that uh, when you're a kid and then you get you're a little bit older and you still have fun with something very special absolutely des moines comic con is back so we're really excited about that um, it's a very fun event it's a celebration of comics toys TV, film, art, cosplay, and a whole lot more. It's out at the Hy-Vee Hall at the Iowa Event Center on Saturday and Sunday, and it starts at 10 a.m. each day. Okay. Yes. So, what's your what's your favorite character? Or who, I, who would I, you be? I'm trying to think of. Uh, you mentioned TV here, and growing up, we always watched this the superheroes on TV. Of course, uh, you know, Batman was very popular. That was a, a big one. But yeah. I think the TV show that I liked the best, uh, Green Hornet. Okay. Yeah. Green Hornet with Kato, uh, which was, uh, you know, Bruce Lee yeah. uh, was Kato. So I think that was probably, I'd probably lean toward that. He had a really cool car, too. What about you? Uh, yeah, well, popular one, Batman, Superman. Yeah. Um, Going to go with another popular one, though, the Hulk. The Hulk. Well, you, you look so similar. Yeah. <laughs> 
To Lou. I don't know if that's a compliment. <laughs> to Bill Bixby or Lou Ferrigno? Yeah, that's, Lou Ferrigno. Yeah. <laughs> that's the question you, yeah. you have to ask yourself. Uh, I'd probably go with Lou because it's a great name. So. You go with that one yep. too. And a very nice guy who has been on this program. He has there been on this program and he's gone out to the zoo with us too. Nice. Uh, when he was in town, when he was in nice. Des Moines. So that is really he cool. He seems like a great guy. Yeah. yeah. Now speaking of uh, you know really cool things that you can do that are really cool. You want to find out more information? Where can you go? CatchDemoines.com. Wonderful. Yeah. Great job as always. Thank you very much. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. This is Iowa Live.